Nokia N76 lower block disassembly and assembly. You will need the following tools, the SS93, a straight bladed screwdriver, metal tweezers, the SS45 camera removal tool, a bit holder with a Torx plus size 4 bit and a torque driver. Keep your tools in good condition. Always replace them if worn out. Check that no battery is inserted before starting disassembling. Flip open the assembly. Shift the SS93 under the menu key of the K-Mate as shown. Now, lever out the K-Mate carefully and discard it. Do not use it again. Carefully insert the flat bladed screwdriver and lever out the clips of the hinge cover top. Lift up the hinge cover bottom. Remove the USB rubber. Another option for SD door removal is shown here. Remove the battery cover first. Unscrew the screw and discard it. Do not use it again. Carefully lever up and hold the D cover into position shown with your fingers. Move the left tab of the SD door to the recess of the D cover. Now the SD door can be removed. Remove the battery cover, unscrew the three screws of the D cover and discard them. Do not use them again. Carefully lever up the coax connector. Open the flex foil connector. Unscrew the four screws and discard them. Do not use them again. Lift up the engine module vertically. Note that this module is connected with a hidden connector. Lift up the antenna module. Remove the DC jack. Use the SS45 to remove the camera module as shown. Remove the microphone and discard it. Gently pry open the hinge cover top. Unscrew the three screws in the order shown and discard them. Do not use them again.
Separate the parts now. Carefully open the connector of the vibra. Lever out the vibra with the SS93. Remove the camera PWB assembly. Unlock and separate the camera PWB from the Bluetooth antenna. Remove the power button. The disassembly procedure is now completed. Assembly. Fit the power button. Place the camera PWB assembly into the Bluetooth antenna. Mind the guide. Insert the camera PWB assembly into the B cover now. Close the connector of the vibra. Place the vibra into its compartment. Bring the upper and lower block into position as shown. Take the three longest ones of the new screws. Insert the three screws. Set the correct torque. Apply the torque in the order shown. Place the hinge cover top. Mind the hooks. Insert the microphone. Insert the camera module with the SS45. Note the correct positioning of the alignment tab. Push it down slightly with the back of SS-45. Insert the DC jack. Mind the side key rubber. Place the antenna module. Mind the guides. Bring the engine module into position as shown. Push it slightly into place vertically. Ensure that the hidden connector is correctly positioned before continue. Note the correct positioning of the cable. Close the flex foil and the coax cable connector. Use the black and shortest ones of the new screws. Insert the four screws. Set the correct torque. Tighten the screws in the order shown. Insert the SD card door as shown. Place the D cover over the engine module. Use the medium lengths of the new screws. Insert the three screws. Set the correct torque. Tighten the screws in the shown order. Place the USB rubber. Align the hinge cover bottom first. 
Slightly click the snaps into their places. Complete the assembly with the battery cover. Flip open the assembly. Peel up the protection film of the new K-Mate. Fit the latches of the opposite side into their recesses. Use the old K-Mate for assembling the new one. Smooth the K-Mate into center position. Remove the protective film. 